Let me turn the music down. It's loud. That's how I like my music. Loud. Hello! Look at you guys using the thingy! You're using the thingy! Yay! Thingy being used. The crab better be the little crab. The thingy's been found. Oh, hold on a second. I got to move the chat. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Get, there you go. Yeah, now we can see you. Hello! Hello! Oh, yeah. So, guys, if, um... Uh, I'll explain the idea thing a little bit for people who are new or people who it's been a hot minute. It's been a hot minute. Um, you can only put up one idea at a time. Um, if you have an idea and you would like to, you can either remove your current idea or you can uh, mark it done and it will leave it up. It'll just strike it out and then you can add another idea if that makes sense. Does that make sense? Um, part of that is to kind of slow down people's ideas but also kind of prevent like a backlog of like Mimi ideas if that makes sense I will stretch because I'm gonna use these as notes later so it's kind of like a filter oh so yeah but like I said if you have if you have two ideas that you feel are really good then feel free to Feel free to, um, you know, add, add both. I'm just gotta, all right, I'm just trying to get my line weight here. Not great. Okay, let's do it this side then. That will, oop, that'll do, pig. That'll do, pig. Okay, so I have, um, boom. All right, we're recording the time lapse because eventually this will be turned into a video. I like that the crab might just scuttle in the spirals moving along the ceiling walls and floors of the coils. Oh my God, that's terrifying. Okay. So I do have, oh, give me a second. Um, I do have like notes for this, this quabby guy. Let me open them up. Let me just read them to you quick. Oh, you are, you crab. Oh, that's a catworm. Oh, crab monster that has a claw, but also a spike on the other side. So not two claws, one claw, one spike. Four legs. The back legs are thicker than the front legs. Um... And it's, it's like two crabs as one crab, but not two crabs, just one crab, but it might, it looks like two crabs. That's what I have so far. It's a legally distinct crab. So, crab has four claws. Basically, it's a spider. No, it has, spiders have eight legs, friend. This crab has four legs. We are drawing the ultimate life form, the crab, today. It's true. We are. So, I have some sketches here. I'm trying to figure out where I can put them without... If I can see them without having to, like... Can I prop them up against my monitor with causing a bunch of issues? I think I can. I have... I have 3D. I have real-life sketches. Okay, I'm going to turn the music down a little bit more. It feels really loud. Give me a second. There you go. Is that better? Let's see. I feel like that's a little better than me. Become Quab. Yes, hello. An octopus also has eight legs. That's correct. I'll put you guys here. There, now we're situated. Now I can see you guys. Hello. All right, so I have... I have... I can draw. Okay. Let's sketch Quab. Sorry. Um, so I'm thinking this Quab is man-sized. So not, not quite as big as the... I mean, this is going to be rough. Um, not quite as large as the Diabora. Because the Diabora is a large boy, right? A ma'am, a large ma'am, if you will. 
Um, so this is about man sized. That ate Jeff. Oh yeah, I forgot about the crabs that ate Jeff. I forgot about them. Yeah, maybe. Maybe this is like the mama crab. What is this music? Did I add this music? No, I didn't. Spotify added that. Silly Spotify. <laughs> I think I like weird music. Crab has large eyes that also rotate. Okay, 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 I like that. See, I like this now because you guys have added so much to it. Like, it can rotate, which is nice. It can scroll, so you guys can just keep adding shiz. But like I said, if you have another idea, you just simply do the done command, and then I'll uh, cross it out for you, and then you can add another one. But then it doesn't get rid of it for me, so I can still use it, if that makes sense. You just can't rapid fire, like, ideas, which is... Which is good. Poor, poor Jeff, man. Just keep, we're just gonna keep making monsters so I don't have to actually start the comic. That's kind of the plan. <laughs> That's the plan. That's how that worked, right? You just simply Simply do not do that. I wish I wasn't so busy. I can't make the wheel. No! Um, I'm going to make... So what I'm doing is not quickly sketching. I'm actually being really slow. Um, I'm going to make like a, a sketch of what I have for the crab. And then if we want to make changes to the sketch by like, you know, adding more legs or less legs or claws or whatever, we can, we can do that. So... If I don't immediately start drawing your idea, do, do not... Do nay fret. So basically, I got the idea for this because I watched a video, horrified, by the way, horrified, of a crab molting its shell, which if you have not seen that, oh boy, it's an experience that I think not everybody can enjoy. How did I do that? What the... Oh, I see. Oh yeah, that bit. Yeah, it's it's horrifying. I was like, this would make a good monster. <laughs> I'm getting into that mentality where I see something truly horrifying. I go, this would make a good monster. I've never seen a spider do it. I did not know spiders molted. That's not something I'd want to experience. The crab was bad enough. What the heck am I doing? Okay, hold on. Trying to recreate this sketch is difficult for some reason. Alright, so we got a little... Okay, you know what? We ball. We're gonna do it this way. Give me a second. Images. Trying to sketch from my sketch apparently is breaking my brain. And there I found the video I was using. Or no, the picture. No, wait, no, I didn't. That's close. It's like the same video, but it's not the same part of the video. Here it is. Here it is. Here we are. Here we are. Yes. Yes. <laughs> okay. It's perceiving a taco. I think with X I don't know. What if they just don't do that? What if they just are born the size and then they stay that size? Okay. So basically we have like a UFO situation. And then crab. Right, crab. Okay. So now the difference is crab. And then you have the underbelly of, of this molting crab. Right, quab. I say quab enough, it'll become true. And then it kind of... In, right? Now it looks like a clam. We already have a cave clam, though. Oh, yeah, that reminds me. I got, I got a message right back. 
Unidentified crab object. <laughs> Dang, your hermit crab is molding. Okay, so basically what I want to do is have like this bit go under this bit. So then it kind of sucks in like this, right? And then instead of like, cause there's like this bit here. Cause it like, I know they leave some of their organs behind. Like I think they leave their gills behind. And a couple other things, and they just grow new ones, right? And it looks really creepy. So, um, I think I think what we'll do is make we'll take this in a little bit to make it more aggressive, right? And then bring that in, bring it in. What am I saying? This is more like a front-facing. Um, situation. Um, I'm looking at like three different references right now. That's why my head's like doing, doing one of these numbers. All right, because I want the eyes like down here. So I was thinking about, I was debating about the eyeballs because I saw someone say something about like large eyes. But I think I'm, we can test that, but I'm feeling like small eyes like that. And then this would actually like down here would be the mouth. And then, but like, what if these were like false eyes and then it had actual eyes that like looked more like crab eyes, like down here. Stone crab, spider crab, um, a molting crab. I don't know what kind of crab it is. It's just a crab. I know these look like uh, sea cucumbers, if you know what I mean, but. I was gonna do it, hold on, I forgot to go, to go live on Twitter. Okay, hold on. I started reading, I didn't wanna read. Okay, let me, let me, let me, let me quote, tweet. We live, we live it crab time, crab time, link, link to, to, str to stream, uh, uh, I'm an adult, post. Not a mere look lurk. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I could see that being a blue color. It's definitely not a hermit crab. I can tell you that much. It's a flat crab. All right. Okay, 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 okay. So then, okay, so he's got like googly eyes. <laughs> right. Okay. So then he's got four legs instead of the... So the back ones are thick boys. Like... Um, people that have like the paradactyl sy syndrome, is that what it's called? Where it's like, it's almost like they're fused. Cause like I said, this is a legally distinct crab, right? It's a legally distinct crab. Crab, 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 crab. Hello, bleach. He does not skip like this. So this crab part is crabby, patty. I'm also thinking, I have extra lore, by the way, about the coils. I don't know if I should sh share it now. I have more lore. Um, share it now or, or save it for another stream. Like a specific stream for that lore. Because I could very easily make a specific stream for that lore and then draw the stuff. But it's something we've talked about quite a bit on stream, so. Put a Krusty Krab hat on him. Let's see if I can do this from memory. Hold on, give me a minute. I used to watch a lot of Spongebob, so it might be possible. <laughs> it's the best I can 
do? Thank you so much. On the coils, they would mess their pants with magic. Away the gross, that's true. Ah, oh, expunge my me boy, I'm stuck in the coils. <laughs> okay, Bleach, are you working right now? Yeah, okay, perfect. So we'll talk about it then. I did a double today. Dang, you're working so much. Crab, hello. So I'm thinking now that we have, so now that we have like the coil, like, all right, fine. But if a patient dies, I'm putting your Twitch like in the, no. <laughs> all right, so he's got four legs, one beef, one set of beefers in the back. He's got them fatties in the back and then one skinny guy. So then on this hand, he's got a spike similar to like one might call on a scorpion. <laughs> I'm so I'm tired. Um I wonder why. Stayed up late streaming last night. Um so I'm a little unhinged and my brain is not firing on all cylinders. So please bear with me. Please bear with me. Yeah, pile bunker crab. Does a crab have joke class like her unlocked? No, that's too silly for me. That's too silly. How many joints does a crab have in their claws? They have quite a few joints, actually. At least this one I'm looking at does. I'd probably make the legs thicker. Right? No bear, only crab. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm tired. So, so please bear with me. My brain is not firing on all cylinders. So if it takes me a while to come up with words, please forgive. Is the spikes fixed or it's a fixed spike, I think. Um, it's not like a robot crab. Uh, and I, I feel like in some cases, specifically in like animals and creatures, uh, simple is better. Right? We don't want to have it like overly complicated. Uh, the animals that tend to have the most efficient, efficient setups tend to be the ones that survive the longest. So crab has to battering ram the spike pretty much. So basically I'm thinking, right? So this side, I'll give him more joints. Yeah, stinger leg, exactly. He's got a spike. I don't know what kind of, I, I, we might, we should workshop the spike here in a minute. But so just general, <laughs> that's so funny with the, I can't take it seriously with the crusty crab hat on. Does it make bubbles with your, no, so. Yeah, so what I've been doing now that I have a little bit more of the lore for the coils, like in my head and on paper and whatnot and what have you, right? Um, is that like I can kind of start figuring out where each of these monsters would like tend to want to hang out. Which is actually making this a lot easier because I can kind of, um, you know, craft them in a way that makes sense. So there is an area. Sorry, Bleach, you're getting the lore dump anyway. <laughs> I know some stinging creatures have like a spring ability attached to the stabbing. Yeah, I'm trying to think about the, I, cause scorpions don't have that, do they? Like how their muscles work. Um, but basically, I've decided on like two like quote unquote safe areas in the coils. Um, one where there is like fresh air, quote unquote. <laughs> Um, so like you wouldn't necessarily need your gas mask in that area. And then one area where like the, there's more fluid, liquid, and it's, it's drinkable. Um, it's not perfectly drinkable, but you know, it's like taking water out of a lake, you know, it's not, it's not, 
you know, engine oil, but it's, you know, you gotta, you gotta treat it a little bit first, right? Do you think these crabs would be plucky Victorian era inspired children with delusions of grandeur? Yeah, we already did. Yeah, we already decided this is what murdered Jeff. Is this a cave crab? No, this is a different, this is a crab of my own design. Did someone submit a crab? Did I miss a crab? I feel like maybe that, no, um, hold on, hold on. Crab. Now that you say that, no. Did anyone submit a crab? Cave fern, cave clam. No cave crab. I'm glad there's a search feature that would have taken forever. <laughs> I was mixing up cave clam and rock bug and rubber. Okay, 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 okay. No, this is the Krusty Krab. Okay, what was I talking about? Oh, so basically, so there's an area where you can like breathe water. Breathe water. Jeez. Um, you can breathe air. Um quote unquote safely and you can there's another area that's in a different part uh that you can uh it has potable water that you can drink okay these yeah we need to workshop these claws a little bit because this is not good they're too small they're too small so basically the idea though guys is that the crab grabs you or another creature in its claw and then it, it, it Caesars you in the back. It Brutus, it to Brutus in the back. And then it puts you in its mouth hole. That's essentially the, the killing ability <laughs> of the crab. So first you get the clamp, then you get the shank, then you get the mouth hole. It's very basic, very simple, right? And like I said, they're about they're about like man sized. Man bear pig, if you will. Owlbang swish. Get all shish kebab. Can we like name this off a play of the word shish kebab? So like if this was a man and that was a crab. Shishka crab. Are they swarmy creatures or lone hunters? Um, uh, that's a good question. I we think they maybe how okay, let me ask you guys this question, and then I will use that question to answer your question. Do you think does this crab, if we get rid of this? Cause that's affecting its IQ. Do you do you think this animal looks smart or dumb? Dumb. Oh guys, I have a story about my mom. I have a story about all mother, by the way. Oh my god. Okay, so it looks like a rock. A little IQ of a pack hunter. I would be afraid. Uh it's an let me think. I suppose lions hunt in packs. No thoughts, just crab. Okay, hold on. Okay, we might need a poll. We might need a poll for this. I'm getting, I'm getting answers all over the board. Can we, Commissar, can we get like a poll for if crab dumb or smart? Oh, don't delete, don't delete your, um, idea, just, just do the done, because if you delete it, I can't keep it for notes. If you just, if you just do, um, exclamation point done, it'll cross it out, and then you can add a new one. Alright, we're gonna just fix man here. 
pull up. Thank you, Commissar. I rewrote. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Oh, no. Please vote if crab's smart or dumb. It's important. Okay, so it's like man-sized crab, right? Man crab. It's not man-sized. <laughs> There, yeah, man-sized crab. But thinks it's a genius. <laughs> Alright, crab has a segmented body that can flip directions quickly. Ooh! Maybe you could do that with its legs. That'd be really freaky. Like, maybe it doesn't walk like a crab. It walks like a... Tick, 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 tick. Let's see. Crab shell is textured to help it blend into rocks and tunnels in the coil. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. I like that. I like that. Using anything but metric to measure. It's true. <laughs> okay. Um, thank you. Guys, the voting has cleared this up for me now. All right, so I want to draw segmented legs now. Leggies. Segmented leggies. All right, so we got general crab idea, right? To operate devices? What kind of devices would a crab be operating? Okay, so basically, it crabs operate pitchforks. <laughs> no, crab, please, no. Oh no, the votes, the votes are getting like, okay, so let's, let's break down a crab leg here. Okay, so basically how a normal crab leg works, right, is you have like your leg and it's like ball and socket joints from what I can tell, right, essentially. They don't have full range of like round movement though, but it's not a hinge. It's not like a hinge like your elbow. Someone didn't play crab soles. Right? But what if they could like, what if they did have full range of movement? So instead of just the leg going down, it can just go up. How would I draw that? How do you draw that? Crab joints. Time to look up crab joints. <sighs> oh, that's a wiggy looking crab. Okay, oh, so they don't really have ball and socket joints. Okay. Crab external anatomy. Crab can also tuck in legs and spin like Beyblade. <laughs> Can't be as delicacy that people in the cities pay a fortune to eat, but unfortunately it cannot be preserved, so they need to get fresh crab. Um, I think we've kind of decided that people don't eat the monsters, maybe? I'm still on the fence about that. Um. Because they live in a toxic environment, and normally if you're eating something that lives in a toxic environment, it too is toxic. You know what I mean? That's my thought process on, like, because I know we've that's kind of gotten brought up a couple times. Um, If people, like, eat or consume the monsters. Alright, so basically you have, like, your crab shoulder. Tell that to puffer fish and jars, but that's different, right? They're not in a toxic environment. They produce their own toxin. All right, so we have your... So as long as you don't eat that organ, you're fine. But if it's like, if you have a fish that lives in water that's constantly having, like, wastewater dumped into it, it's not safe to eat the fish. Crab is dumb. Okay, crab is dumb 
Crab is solo hunter. Solo hunter. Classic fish, exactly. Oh my god, I was trying to read- I was trying to read Arcus's science. Bioaccumulation. Depends on the animal, but yeah, it can happen. Usually animals will become toxic, but most plants tend to fend all the toxins. Though, obviously, exceptions. To go crab vard. <laughs> to crab vard. I get it. Alright, so we have, like, the joint. Okay, so, like, normal crab joint can go, like, this way, and then, like, sort of this way. But what if we- so ball and socket joints can kind of go everywhere. So I like the idea that the entire crab is ball and socket. I feel like that would cause issues as far as strength goes, but we don't have to we don't have to break it down that hard, right? Crabs are dumb as shit. You don't have to put a lid on the crab. <laughs> He's got a point. He's got a point. Yeah, I feel like it's a uh... I feel like it's very, like, it'll squish itself into tight places and wait for something to come near it, and then it kind of goes like... You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Just like that. That's that's his hunting method. Um, I know it's very scientific. I really hope it doesn't go over anybody's heads. I know sometimes I tend to do that. <laughs> Yeah, the exoskeleton gives it more flexible movement based off the armor. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, okay. So, everything's a ball joint. So, we have the leg, right? And then it's a ball joint. And then you have the leg. And then you have... So, I like that idea because, like, we can add the rocky bumpiness. What if we added, like... Okay, so this is its, like, shoulder joint. So, this is... A shoulder... Right, and then I want this to be bigger though. Oh, but you can't make it too big because then that'll restrict movement. Oh my god, this is so difficult. Okay, so whether we can make it bigger this end. What if we just made it like, what if he's got like, what if he's ripped, right? He looks like he's got big biceps. <laughs> Never thought I'd be looking up crab anatomy five years ago. I'm sorry, I keep burping into the mic. I really hope you guys don't hear that. I really do. Yes, the Goku crab. And then here. I can't draw how I am imagining it moves because I would need to animate that. But basically, um, what movie is that? Is that The Exorcist or The Exorcism Emily Rose? Or the one with the video? I don't know. Like, the one is a scary movie and, like, the girl, like, flips her legs all around, like, backwards and she's, like, runs across the ground, like, upside, like, upside down and backwards. The ring? Okay, maybe it was the ring. Like that. So it, it just, like, all of a sudden be like, <laughs> and just starts, like, skittering at you quickly. Ah, the grunge! It was the grunge! That's what I was thinking. The grunge, the grudge. Yeah, so that's how he moves. Our quab. That's the one in Japan, right? Yeah, oh my god. The part where, like, she, like, is talking to that one girl and the girl turns around and her bottom jaw is gone. I screamed and cried and turned off my TV and I had, I had to wait, like, three years before I could watch it after that. I don't think a crab would like being upside down. How come? Why no crabby like being upside down? I've never had a crab, so I honestly don't know. Crabs aren't Australian. Fair enough. All right, no, it's okay. Per, per, per. Okay, wait, hold on. My brain's not working a hundred percent, though. There we go. That's better. 
I think he needs more than, because he's got one joint up here and then another joint like here. I think he needs another joint. I think we need to add another joint in this quab. Special hooks need to not fall off the ground are a pain. That's true. I don't know if it would go on the ceiling. I don't know how spiders stay up on stuff. I am Australian. <laughs> Neko's like, trust me, I know <laughs> from experience. Don't they have like hairs? Isn't that how they stick to stuff? He just believes in that's how. Static force. I like static shock. Spiders are tiny, so it could work. Yeah, I don't know. There's got to be some, like, biological thing, though. I don't think it's just because they're... I don't... Someone else is going to have to Google it because I cannot. I can't. At the risk of seeing spider pictures, I just, I just don't want to do that today. <laughs> I'm not mentally prepared for spiders. Technically, it's like little hooks. Oh, okay. Yes, crabs are very good climbers because their legs have enough texture to grip onto walls. Okay, so he could climb. He could be a climber. Oh, yeah, I forgot about geckos. I've never... I've never petted a spider. I don't do spiders. I have the spider, I have the spider thing on in, in Lethal Company. Please do not. <laughs> ah! Uh, please spoiler the spiders if you do, I'd appreciate it. Yeah, that arachnophobia filter. Okay. How do muscles work up? Okay. Thank you. Okay, so basically ball and joint sockets work because there's like muscles that pull. It's okay. We're thinking too hard. It's, it's, it, it doesn't have to be perfect science. It's a crab. A shed pit. It's, it's like uh, getting chased by a giant word almost is worse. Found a large tree boy with good anatomical references. Ah. Spiders use van der Waals forces from special triangular hairs on their feet to stay attached to the ceiling. Interesting. Huh. Alright, so we got his leg. So... Ball. And socket. Joints. Can flip. Flip limbs. How's that sound? There we go. That sounds good. All right, let's do this and make it smaller. What is this from? Oh, this is from Apothecary Diaries. I was like, why does it sound familiar? If more robotic... Nope, this is a... Whoa, this is an organic creature. Um, I don't want to make the canvas bigger, but I don't want to get rid of everything else. Oh, you know what? Let me move everything over this way. Okay, that doesn't work either. We'll just turn it off for now. There we go. Ta-da. Okay, okay, so we got crab... 
crab has large eyes. Crab has segmented a body that can flip quickly. All right, we did that. Crab shell is textured to help blend into walls and tunnels of the coral. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crab gone. Crab is gone. It's okay. Crab will be back. Okay, so we have, like, crab. All right, so we have, like, the top of the shell. So from the top, this guy looks like his butt will draw his booty. I don't know if the top is the best way to show texture. What am I doing? It's fine. Is there a rock bug? No, it's crab. Um, I'm going to say the crab does not exist in a watery, uh, thing. In a watery area. I was debating about putting it in, like, the safe, the safe area that's, like, watery. Um, but I... Do I want to do that? Like, he could, but I'm also trying to make a legally distinct crab. So, like, taking it out of water would be, like, the easiest way to do that. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Amphibian crab? Nah. It doesn't really need to be amphibian. Crab uses moisture from the cave walls. I like this shape, and I can't get it on this side. <laughs> like, distinct crab is the whole reason why everything evolves into crabs, because they aren't copyrighted. Yeah, but this is like a crab from another world. That would be a good isekai, like, manga. Instead of, like, you isekai as a hero, you just isekai into a crab from a, a legally distinct world. Just be like, I was hit by a bus and now I've become a legally distinct crab in a legally distinct world. I, well, okay, so, uh, I'm trying to figure out how to explain this to you guys without causing a ruckus. So, there's a little bit that I don't know how to explain without revealing plot. Or I can just tell you and let you guys be confused. Um, but now that I've said that, I feel like I have to just tell you and let you be confused. And not let you know... Why? <laughs> so, um, don't bother asking why, because I'm not going to explain it. Um, I'm literally two steps from being a brain veggie. Um, these animals, these creatures, they do not breed. There's no males and females, and they do not breed. Same. <laughs> Goose does not breed. <laughs> so, yeah. I know that's something that's kind of getting brought up a lot every time I'm like, oh, I don't know if I should tell them or not. So, no breeding. Should we have? Are you gonna make coil R thirty four now? We just <laughs> no monster fucking. Do not fuck the monsters, Arcus. Please, I beg. No, oh my God. Deborah's the only one that's a man. Deborah's a. It's like a vault. One of the vaults. One man with a thousand females. Deborah's the only man. De 
time we can get in. No, why? Why is it 69? That's terrible. Also nice. Yeah, so the coil is just fault 69. <laughs> All right, so here's... I really just want to turn on the symmetry tool so I don't have to keep redrawing every side of the stupid crab. All right, so... Maybe these aren't false eyes. Maybe these are, it's a four eyes. Maybe it's a nerd. Maybe the crab's a nerd. What if it was a nerd crab? Okay, and then we got the ball and socket joints right here. So we got one big one in the back, right? And one smaller, normal size one in the front. And then there's a whole gobbledygook of crap for for the, the front for the front things. Crabs have ten eyes? I don't know, Argus, I'm looking at a lot of pictures of crabs and none of them have ten eyes. Imagine, oh, I thought you were calling it a dork. You're like, imagine a dork crab. Dork. Whatever eats giant crabs. Yeah, no, for real. I wonder how strong this crab is, though. Like, it's dumb. We've established it's dumb. The dork part of the dork. <laughs> All right, and then this is like its mouth. This is where the, the dump hole. I imagine also these things eat like everything they can find. So if they find scraps, they'll eat scraps. They'll eat people. They'll eat rocks. I don't know. They might be super dumb. Who really knows? Horseshoe. Oh, horseshoe crabs. They don't look like crabs. They're like fake crabs. I know they're real crabs, but they don't really look like crabs. They're like poser crabs. I have to finish the gulpa beetle too. That crab ate my children. All I got was a stupid t-shirt. Alright, sorry. I'm just trying to draw bits so that we can add texture to them. Like I said, I'm not firing on all cylinders. I'm sorry. It's only Tuesday. I'm going to be suffering for the rest of the week. We're drawing tomorrow too. Yes, crabs can detect vibrations. Marine crustaceans, including crabs, have many sensory hairs in their bodies that can detect vibrations in water and on the substrate. For example, fiddler crabs use their leg sensory organs to detect sand particle vibrations. Fiddler crabs can detect vibrations at low frequencies. It knows when you fart. It knows. <laughs> That's how it hunts. Fart detection! You know I'm afraid to fart now. Yeah, what if you fart and a crab comes running in your room to attack you? That would actually be really funny for like a little like short comic, like a funny comic. Like you know how like back in the day when you would buy like a manga and they just had those short little funny comics in the back? Don't fart in your home, a crab might eat your butt. You never know. The omake? What's the omake? Is that what those are called? Forcoma? Yeah, forcoma. Basically an anime over OVA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the Tremor Circle sequel. I can't talk. Oh my god, I'm suffering. I'm suffering. Put me down. Put the chicken down. Did you guys enjoy the stream last night for those who made it to the gorilla stream? Yeah, Omake had the bonus comics in the manga volume. Usually they are humorous, yes. I realized I was like, um, I was like, damn, I might be a loud person. Me trying to, <laughs> me trying to like, 
um, advertise myself as like quiet and cozy and stuff. And that might be wrong. These seem too like. What if I did this? Chickens aren't quiet though. I I don't know. I've always been trying to advertise myself as like comfy cozy, and I'm starting to think that's not. <laughs> I started to think that's not the case. Have I been wrong for four years? Guys, chat, is this real? Have I been wrong for four years, chat? You can be complex. Damn, I don't know if that's a compliment or not. It's mostly when you play games that you're allowed to listen, drawing, and stuff. Realize your fan groups. I don't want I I'm gonna be okay. Look, I'm like real talk guys real talk There's There's times where I sat down. And I'm like, I don't understand How I got this group of fans <laughs> And it's nothing that I'm not like holy crap. How did I end up with these fucks? It's nothing like that It's just like I'm just like I don't understand What happened like where is this coming from? I'm a comfy cozy streamer and I have all these crazy people. You know? I'm starting to realize that maybe maybe that's not the case. <laughs> like attract like just stop being afraid to look in there. No! <laughs> I'm a normal person. <laughs> I'm comfy. Life. My washing machine does not have a normal setting, so. It has a heavy, it has a standard, it has. It's limit. This is very long. <laughs> Am I a gremlin? Have I been a gremlin all along? I've never used an actual washing machine. What? What what do you mean you've never used do you use a washboard? Goose, are you truly like a boomer that I didn't realize? Oh yeah, permanent press. Still don't understand what that means. There's no way you use a washboard. I don't believe it. But now just a laundromat. Is there not a washing machine at the laundromat? I have a hand washing machine. What? Do you use it? All right. So big, big, big cloth. I have a washing machine. I, I also have a washing machine. Guys, are you okay? Chad, are you okay? <laughs> Not every country has washing machines in their home. Yeah, but Goose lives in my country. My my washing machine came with my house. <laughs> so it's probably 40 years old. Yeah, our country is huge. That means nothing. I mean, I feel like a good majority of our country has washing machines. Except for maybe Appalachia. Rumpus room. Oh my god. Alright. So if you were going to get pinched by a crab claw, would you want a skinny crab claw or would you want a thick boy crab claw before you got a spike to the chest? Because he's not the boonies. He's like those people in Appalachia who haven't seen a D. See, I think Goose might actually be a 90-year-old woman. I Fiddler crab? Okay, let me look up a fiddler crab. Oh, damn! That boy's thick! Look at that lad! That, that claw's bigger than him. How does he lift that? Why do you got tiny the other claw is? What the hell is this? <laughs> Bro, he only do arm day on the left.
left side. We never do arm day on the right side. You can tell he, you can tell what he does in the shower a lot. Fiddler crab. <laughs> shower, what a coward. One claw so he can hold his fiddle, the other thing so needs to hold the bow. <laughs> Is that what they're called a fiddler crab? Are they tiny? Oh my god, are they tiny? Oh my god! Can I have one as a pet? Can I have a fiddler crab? I think if I had a pet fiddler crab, I'd name him 4chan. <laughs> Look at that lad, dude. His eyes are amazing. Put it on throne. I'm not putting an animal on throne. That's insane. That's insanity. Okay. Damn. Oh, is the bottom one fixed? Oh, yeah, it is fixed. Okay, 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 okay. I'm not putting an animal on throne. That feels fucked up. Okay, hold on. We gotta... I gotta... I don't like this arm. I gotta see the other parts. There you go. Okay, so Fiddler Crab's joints are just two. He just has two. Because strong. Guys, Ramen would eat a Fiddler Crab. He would eat it. Destroy it. I'm trying to see, like, the other part of its leg. There we go. It's like big boy. Can Rama get in the closure with its fucked up claws? Um, you know how, like, you always have that one friend who is really dumb, but always gets into, like, really ridiculous situations and none of them are good? That's Ramen. So, yes, I believe he could absolutely get into the tank. <laughs> He's a lovable bean. He's an old man, though. How old is he now? 14? 15? <laughs> 14. He's gonna be 14. So he's 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 uh not not late stage, but he getting there. Okay, so then you have another ball joint. We discover fiddler crabs. I'm trying to figure out how their joints work. There's not really good pictures of like here we go. Oh, okay, we're just throwing Calliope more. I just want I just want the record to show I did not add Calliope more to this playlist. That's right, a gamma day. Happy birthday, Gamma. We were running that gun, trying to escape. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I once knew a cat that was 30. It was old grumpy man that liked to sleep under the fig tree. Aww. Oh, right. I for he forgot it was his birthday. He forgot. Alright, alright, all right. Okay, I finally got the joints on this lead. They're, they're shorter. I'm sorry. I'm struggling. I'm not used to drawing crabs. I'm not used to being a crab person. Crab people, crab people. I put a Mori figure on my throne for the little- I have one! She right here next to me! 
I have the the, the smile, the happy smile. What is it? Good smile? Good smile. I have the good smile figure. You shine as a wonder. Making stronger. The best of the days today. All right, so this boy, this part, fat boy, Doki Army. I keep meaning to catch her streams, but she never streams when I can watch streams. Then again, I don't really watch a lot of Callie's streams either, unfortunately. I mostly listen to her music. It's the best I can do. I feel very disconnected from my Oshi. It's a sad day. I watched Callie play Armored Court. Ah, oh, yeah, I wanted to. She's... I like I wanted to, but I knew I was gonna get self-conscious because she seemed really good at it. The scuff queen is that Amelie, or does Doki have a lot of scuff too? He. We gotta move you, lad. We gotta move you over. Thank you. Oh, fiddler crabs as pets. How to care for fiddler crab. Lifespan. 10 to 20 years? Fiddler crabs live to 10 to 20 years? He can live as long as ramen? Oh my god. Brackish salt water. Specific gravity. Provide dry land space for gravel, sand, and rocks. Keep temperature. Oh yeah, see, I cannot take care of this poor fiddler crab. As much as I would like the fiddler crab, I cannot take care of a fiddler crab. <laughs> they fiddle for a long time. Dang, I did not know that. This is why... This is why not just putting an animal on your throne is, is good. We don't impulse buy animals. Okay, guys? Never impulse buy an animal. And the disc turd. Oh! Commissar! The thinky face. Guys, 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 guys. I totally forgot. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> uh, give me a second. I gotta figure out how to start it. Hold on. Hold on, guys. There's something important you need to know. That was supposed to start last week, I think. But it's gonna start this week. Yeah, I just saw that. That's why I remember, because I saw the dude. Um, how do I do this? Okay. Ready? Are you ready, guys? Something's about to happen. Da 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 da! A community challenge has started. I'm not gonna explain what it is. All I'm gonna say is the Drunk Chicken Army stream. You guys have 30 days to contribute 250,000 points, and if you do, we shall have a Drunken Chicken Army stream. Dun dun dun. <laughs> I was smarter this time. I didn't make it 40,000. You guys got to do work this time. Yeah, no, not even Commissar has context. No one does. I've told no one. It's just myself. I have 102 points. I can just dump, except there's a max. You can't just dump 102 right away. <laughs> All right, back to Quab. Thank you, Commissar, for reminding me, because I kept forgetting. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, uh, yeah, that is a good reference for a crab. Oh, coconut crabs make me sad. Okay. For I forget, VTuber band win. What do you mean VTuber band? Like a rock band? Only 2k at a time. I believe it's uh, per stream. 
It's either per stream or per day. All right, back to Quab. All right, so yeah, I did not realize that. Um, do to do. Musical student. You want me to get a whole ass band together? I'm trying not to burp again. I had a soda. That's why I'm slightly awake. I shall contribute. There you go. Now we're at 12k already. Oh my god. She had my pop. Yeah, I had my pop. Invite me, I'll play- please tell me you actually play the accordion. I may or may not want to audition. <laughs> um, I am in, in no position to do it. <laughs> Anything with a band. I can only play it because I play piano, not because I learned it brutal. Do you play polka? Do you play polka, Arcus? A Mandalorian is a in great instrument, by the way. TikTok duets, let's go. TikTok makes me sad. <laughs> All my video, like, shorts platforms are tanking, and I have no idea why. I've given up on short form content. <laughs> she insults my people. Please play polka, <laughs> our kids. Now, I do play piano and cello, mostly classical and jazz, but I want to learn some bluegrass stuff with my cello so I can show up at the farmer markets and play. Arcus is going to be a busker. Oh. Wait, I forgot I can't do that. Mandalorian. Oh my god, if you guys had like a, a, a clucker meetup at like a bluegrass fest, that would cause me great amount of psychic damage, I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> an actual, an actual amount of psychic damage. I would become like log. Airport has a thing where peeps can sign up to play in the food court. Is it like a piano? There's, there was an airport I was at. They had like a big piano and anyone could just like jump up and play it. 3d6 psychic damage per round of exposure. Yes, exactly. Not for money. At the farmer's market, I mean, there's just people who show up and play with their instruments for fun. Been like that since, a kid, since I was a kid. Oh, that's pretty cool. BYO instrument. Oh. Yes, only play anime song covers. Okay, so we finally have one claw. On this <laughs> now I have to fit the other claw that's not a claw on this crab I can't actually read music which is really fun um I it just it's never clicked in my brain I don't know why you're gonna learn I don't yeah that's that's kind of my goal with the piano thing is to, like actually learn how to read music. Um, I've been like people have attempted to teach me a lot, <laughs> but the school goes confuse me. Like I get the general idea, but to, like memorizing what notes are what just is I'm lost. Reading music is kind of hard to learn, but super easy once you get yeah. It was a struggle when I was a kid, so I can only imagine how easy it's going to be now that I'm an adult. But yes, I will, I will. I did the, the piano I put on there has like a MIDI, MIDI nonsense, so I can at some point play music on stream if it ever gets to that, which would be cool. No. 
Ooh, what if I just, just to show that the joints can flip flop, we just add the pokey guy over here like this. I forgot to write a note. We will see though. If it, if it, it will be a while. I want to be able to at least like play a couple songs like, um, confidently before I'd ever stream it. Maybe, I don't know. Or maybe I'll stream me fucking up a lot. I don't know. <laughs> Let's add another layer of content onto my stuff, why don't we? Two left hands with a purpose, it's true. There's no foot pedals though. I never understood what the foot pedals were for on a, a piano. I think it's changing octaves, but... Okay, so I feel like... Lots of layers, like an onion. What if I just... I don't know. I feel like if I just have like the pokey here, then it's just kind of like it's like shaking your fist. Stain as a pedal. I'm talking months for me. I still got all the other crap I have to get done, but I do have lots of musical equipment to screw on. But that's nice. Put pedals to mute the strings. Oh, I didn't know that. Pasta crab. Yeah, exactly. That's what it looks like. It looks like a pasta crab. All right. I don't like. I don't want pasta crab. <laughs> I think we'll just add another joint and then. I don't like that. I really want to start working on like the actual characters. <laughs> I want to start working on the actual characters for Elysium Skip so that like it's not just Quab. You know what I mean? But it's scary. And I I actually I really, 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 really I know it's hard to believe. I really struggle with character designs. Um, I can do, like, monsters and stuff and animals, like, nobody's business, but, like, actual character designs are, are rough for me. One me strings, one sustains all the notes, one sustains only the notes being played when it's pressed. Oh, neat. Okay. Interesting. Oh boy. Another storm is rolling in. Alright, we're gonna pasta crab. Seafood pasta monster. Piano is what I trained on since I hated the trumpet. I had like piano piano. Piano I had piano lessons for like a hot minute, but then because I struggled to read music, it was uh it was dropped. The piano lessons were dropped. <laughs> So, oh, which reminds me, guys, I have to tell you a crazy story. They ran out of time, so I chose cello. It'd be fun to play the cello. I'd like to learn the violin, too, but I heard the violin's very hard. And the piano's slightly easier. Um, so, the other day... Hello, sweet. I did violin in elementary school. Also hated it. Oh my god. <laughs> the other day, I get a call from All Mother, right? I'm on my lunch break. I'm playing a video game. The fiddle and the violin are the same instrument. Um, I'm playing a video game on my lunch break instead of eating, right? As one does. As one does. And, and, hold on. Hold on, I gotta look up something. Animals. I'm trying to figure out like a spike to use. I don't want to just use like a scorpion tail or just like a standard spike. I'm trying to look up another animal that has spikes. Um, so I'm playing a video game, enjoying myself as it were, and I get a call from All Mother. And she's like, Hey, I'm at this car wash. Can you I know you're working, but it's kind of an emergency. Can you come here? I was like, what's up? And she's like, it just, I, I'm okay, but I need you to come here. Right? And I'm like, okay, well, that's mildly freaky. <laughs> so I go there and my, my mother's car has a sunroof. And she went through the car wash and it was the kind with the, the whippy 
the whippy red brushes. The red whippy brushes. And somehow, one of the red whippy brushes caught the sunroof and ripped it open mid car wash. <laughs> so all of a sudden, the car is filling with water. It's filling with soap. The, the she can't close the sunroof because it literally got ripped like like a big chunk of metal like one of the piston guys got ripped off the frame. So like that, so her car is literally filled with soap and water and then like it keeps forcing her through cuz it's not it's like one of the ones you like drive onto and it like drags you through. Right? You can't you don't pull forward. And uh so it pulls her through and then it pulls her through the fan and the air pressure is so high she said you couldn't breathe because the air was moving too fast and it blew like she had lunch she had gone out to lunch with a friend so she had like her styrofoam to go thing sitting on the passenger seat and that like exploded from the air pressure like just blew everywhere so not only did like the styrofoam like blow up but then it like fired like shot the food everywhere and like her purse exploded like everything in her purse went flying everywhere and she couldn't breathe and then like she got it finally released her from this hell she pulls over gets out of her car sits on the ground and then passes out Like, holy shit. Yeah, because she, she said her heart rate was just like through the roof because. Yeah, she's okay. It was, um, <laughs> she's like me, even though she says she's not and like will pass out easily when heart rate go too high. Um, yeah, so she's fine. Um, luckily her insurance covered the cost of the repairs and the cleaning and then the insurance is going after the car wash so she doesn't have to do that. Uh, so this is kind of like the best ending. It was really bad though because like the car wash people wanted to call an ambulance for her because she passed out. <laughs> and if you're in the US, an ambulance ride can cost you anywhere from like 800 to $2,500 and that's like just the ambulance ride. That's not the medications or anything. So she's like, I don't want an ambulance. And I'm like, okay, well you can't drive because you just passed out. And like I've passed out a bajillion times in my life and it's very disorienting. And, you're, and then she's like, I'm going to drive home. And I'm like, no, you're not. So then I had to like fist fight my mom <laughs> to get her to chill. <laughs> Yeah, so careful with the car washes that have the brushes if you have a sunroof. Yeah, she's okay. She's fine. She got home. They're fixing her car. So, like, it's kind of the best ending it can be at the moment. There you go. How's that spike? That's a good spike. Reminds me of Final Fantasy. One ended with cookies, the other ended with a juice box. Oh, yeah. I don't know why I pass out still. <laughs> it's just neat. <coughs> One time, the police forced my brother to take an ambulance a total of three blocks for a nice $2,000 fee. Yeah. I've luckily never had to get in an ambulance. I don't know if I could... I think I think the panic of being in an ambulance would cause me to pass out. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? <laughs> I would just pass out again from the sheer anxiety involved with being in an ambulance and the cost. So. But yeah, she's fine. But her car is, it was, oh my god. Like, I looked in the car and it was just sopping wet. And like, the electronics was wet. You know what I mean? Because, like, it just shot straight onto her dash. And, like, she said there was water pouring out of, like, the dashboard. <laughs> like, after the water stopped, there's water. But that's what I said. I was like, you'll just put it in a bag, turn it off, put it in a bag of rice when you get home, it'll be fine. 
But she's taking it in to get it serviced now that they know, you know, that she got like a quote and the insurance cleared it and everything. So she's taking it in. The ambulance is free in Australia, even if the tents is carrot. So like, like, yes, that's true. You also have like insanely high taxes compared to us. So like, it's not technically free, right? Not that that makes it okay, but I'm just saying it's not really free. I don't like the idea that people will choose to risk their lives versus having a, you know, some medical care, but not a fan of that at all. Bill is free in USA if you just don't pay the bill. That's true. Simply don't pay the bill. All right, so we got Lance Crab. All right, I need to name this something, and I think Lance is something good. All right, let's see. Another, let's see. Um, Roman word for Lance? That's a Roman word for javelin throwing spear. Oh, Lensea. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense actually <laughs> wow who would have thought that latin that lance came from a latin root that's insane who would have thought an english word would have a latin root we the community can help build on the monster lord right lance crab gladiator crab i don't want to name it crab that's my one thing i don't want to do um but yes shuggle you can um the the my general rule of thumb for these is I might not take your idea for this specific monster, but I might take it for a different monster. Um, so no idea is a bad idea. Just don't get upset if I don't apply it like at the monster, if that makes sense. Um, the other thing too, for those who don't know, there is a section in my Discord server if you are in it. Um, it's called Elysium Skiff. Anything in the minor reports is community added. Um, and basically what I'm in the process of doing, and it's taking a very long time, but it's happening. Uh, I am building a wiki that will eventually be up and people can browse through it. And all of the mods, well, not a lot of the mods. I don't want to say all because there might not be some that just don't fit. Um, a lot of the monsters and equipment and um, companies that people are adding to that miners report is going into the wiki. And then, of course, I credit you and everything. Um, yeah. So then, like, are in, and a lot of these monsters I plan on having videos for um, with voice acting and art and stuff. So if that's something you're excited about, please fill out a miners report for your monster. Um... If you're trying to fit it in for the world, there's world facts. And that's a very basic rundown of everything. Um, but if you have any questions, you can either ask me or the community. Everyone's kind of well-versed now on almost everything that I have in my head. So, yeah. Yeah. But please. No idea is a bad idea. Some just might not fit. You know what I mean? Ambush crab. This is my point. He's like, hello. Bibbidi bobbidi. Okay, we need to we need to remove the word crab though. I know it looks like a crab, but we need a legally distinct crab. You know like how one's pal world and one's Pokemon? Let's okay, so we have okay, hold on, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a note. So this is how I normally handle these sorts of things. So then um Gaelic word for crab. I'm sure there's a word. Proton I don't know I don't know if I'm saying that right. Eclism clis clis How do I say that though? I can't speak Gaelic, guys. Can you say it for me, computer? Computer, please. It doesn't say it for me. This is truly a cursed day. 
Try looking at German words, but the best can find was <laughs> Lanzakrabe, yes. Say the word. Masculine. Well, that's the thing with Gaelic is that um, a lot of the words don't, the, the letters don't make the same sounds. I gotta see if I can find a website where they... Audio pronunciation. There we go. Oh, and the Norse word for crab is crabby. That's so cute. I chose Terra Barare because it's Latin for to pierce. Sounds cooler than Lancea. That's, your mom sounds cooler than Lancea. How about that? How about that? Oh, I'm sorry. Porton! Can you guys hear it? I don't think you can. Give me a second. Here. Here, wait, 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 wait. Let's pause music. Here. Porton. Here you go. Porton. Porton! Porton. Porton. Stabby the Krabby. <laughs> no. Um, On the naming conventions I've been using throughout the story has been um, Roman or Gaelic is kind of the things I've been mixing together to fit with the, um, the theme. Portan. Concron. Ooh. Concron. 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 Oh, that's that's a grumpy person. Kangran. Crab meat. Crouton. Let's name it Crouton. Drish. Oh, jeez. Drish. 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 Portan. 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 Lantan. What's lantan mean? Alright, let's get some music back. Burp. Lance and Oh! Oh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. She'll go up the I smell you. Portance. Portance. I just call it Portance. Because it impales people and it's based on a fiddler crab. Oh, I get it. That's that's clever. Where did that Wawa go? Water. I need you. I don't really like Lantan or Portance better. The Latin word is cancer. It's cancer, guys. <laughs> All right, I got Portance. Call it a poor tans. All right, let me try that again. Perchance you get this. Perchance you get the stab. Oh no, goose! No, not the crabs. Poor tans. The poor tans. I I feel like it needs another word. Like poor towns crab, but we're trying not to have crab. It's fine. Poor towns is fine. Is the lore for the crab they harvest its blood like horseshoe crab? Um, nope. This would just be another monster that you would uh take its bones. Oh, 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 oh! My brain. Hold on, hold on. Thank you, Buddha. No, no, no. Right. Okay. Right. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Hold out. Right, because like the the stones are in the bones. Right? But it's got an exoskeleton, which means the stones are in the bones. It's a, it's shiny. He's shiny. <laughs> He's a shiny crab. You'd have bones stones on the outside. Moana flashbacks. I'm shiny! I, I hated that song. Shiny! 
Gamma gets it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's going to have, like, veins on him that are, like, shiny rocks. What a lad! What a Chad! All right, what time is it? I am going to cut the stream a little early today. I don't want to, but I'm really tired, and I don't need to have two nights in a row being up late to then have to stream tomorrow morning. Can I put him in my rock tumbler? You could try. You're welcome to try. He's man-sized, though, so you need, a, like, a big rock tumbler. Bedazzled crab. I'll look up Gaelic rocks. Perhaps that can be a fancy pattern. Um, they'd probably be at random, I think. Okay, so here's the thing. Like, as cool as a pattern would be, right? Because that would be very cool, and that's a good idea. Um, I do have to, like, draw these a lot, because it's supposed to be for a webcomic, right? So, I can't do anything too intricate, because that would break my brain, if that makes sense. But having, like, a random swirly pattern isn't too bad. Because they don't have to be exact. Bedazz, Lan Bedazz Lancer, yes. Um, okay. So what we're going to do... I really wish we could have gotten a little bit farther on this guy, but it's okay. There's a lot of brainstorming going on. <laughs> he looks like an Italian, though. Bibbidi boppity Get off my crabby property. Rhinestone portants. Porta, porta, la, la. Ooh, I kind of like that. You cook a da pizza. You fuck out your mom. <laughs> okay, I need to go to sleep. Um, I want to raid somebody. Does anyone have any suggestions to raid somebody that we haven't raided before? The rhinestone cowboy. If not, we'll find somebody else. Take care, everyone. Thank you for coming, Goose. Such a fun stream. I'm really glad I pushed myself to bring it to come. I'm glad you were here, Juggle. Thank you for coming. Let's find somebody. I'm looking too. So if someone comes up with an option. My boy Mike is streaming. Is that his VTuber name, Mike? Can you throw a link? Can you throw a link at me, Buddha? Is that his VTuber name? The pink lady from yesterday? We should write Pickle one of these days. Mike Burn Fire. Let me check out Mike here. Michael. Judging him. Oh, is he a duck? What's happening? Oh, an ad! He is a duck! Your bro Mike is a duck! Okay, hold on a second. Okay, you know what? Okay, let's do a pickle. Let's do a pickle raid this one time because we haven't raided pickle in a hot minute. She's raided me a bunch of times. I will keep Mike on a follow. And then we can always raid Mike next time. So... Let's raid, let's, let's, let's raid Pickle. Pickle VT. Guys, what do you want to scream? No, 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 yo, crab people, crab people. We got crab people, spam crabs. Okay, are you ready? Thank you guys for coming. I'm streaming tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. Eastern. So you morning people, you better be there. I swear to God, I will kill all of you. All right, goodbye. Have a good night. Bye-bye.